Hi everyone, Phil from statisticsmentor.com. So one time I explained to my students about what the hat matrix does. It projects Y onto the column space of X. And I showed them this picture to see that. So Y is projected onto column space of X. And this H is a orthogonal projection. So in other words, we've got a right angle here. That's a shorter distance between Y and Y hat. And this distance here is the residual. A student of mine came to me and said, look, this is a picture that I've been, we've seen in an uh, introductory stats course for regression, bivariate regression, X and Y. Come to your picture here, my data point here, to the line, then looks like this should be the residual, rather than this. Do you get the problem? Because we're told in the our course is that this is residual, and of course this is the residual. Well, why isn't this residual? If we look at the picture here, this is the right angle. Here to the line, fitted line, should be right is a right angle as well. Only this is not the residual. How can we explain why is that? Well, I can completely see why the, why the student asked that, and uh, that was a fair question. And it's this, that this picture, and this is not the same because in bivariate regression, what you have, your X matrix is going to be 1, 1, 1, X1, X2, to Xn. And then what you have is your column space is made up of this vector of 1s and this column vector of Xs, which if you sketched it out looks nothing like this. In other words, it's a different kind of picture we're looking at. So if we drew this in a column, drew this, it'll be some kind of hyperspace because we've got loads of you know hyperspace. So then we get still get something like this if we think about it into um, and so this is more the interpretation that matches this than this. And that's all it is and I hope that's clear. Okay, take care.